It's a different feeling up here. I mean, this lake is just massive. It's nearly impossible for me to put into context on how big it is. It's an eerie yet humbling feeling to be sitting on the top of the lake with over 1400 feet of water below you. You gotta be careful out here. The weather can change fast and if you're not careful and not respecting this lake, it'll, it'll swallow you up pretty quick. And standing on land that has never been touched before or hasn't been since our indigenous ancestors have hundreds or even thousands of years ago. Sacred is honestly the best way that I can describe this feeling. Spanning across the Sawtu region in the Northwest Territories of Canada is Great Bear Lake, the largest freshwater lake completely surrounded by Canadian borders and ninth largest lake in the world, with a depth of 1,463 feet and a shoreline covering 2,719 kilometers. This historic lake covers an area of 31,153 square kilometers. And to put that into perspective, Great Bear Lake would swallow up Belgium or the entire state of Maryland. With less than 300 people fishing this lake every year, I can't find the right words to describe how lucky and blessed I am to be invited on such a trip. Our bags were pretty close to the max weight and uh, we didn't have very much room so representing the muck boots this uh, very hot day feet are absolutely sweating in We've got a few uh, minute wait before we catch our flight to the Roman Wells and fly out to Great Bear Lake on Monday. Monday. Today is Saturday. Yeah, Couple got days. A, got a day, day to wander around Norman Wells and stuff. Tabor's going to take us out on some hikes and just kind of see the country. It's really cool. Beautiful up here. First time being up here so. So Kiyoma's dad, where we're going up to the cabin, does taxidermy. And this is some of his work that he's got going on. Some grizzly bears, which were nuisance bears. This one's going to be in the airport. Some wolverines, a lot of muskox, sheep. It's 
pretty cool. I just want to show you the claws on this guy. Look at that. That is incredible. Hello. How are you? What's your name? Is that the benefit of every street you go down there's a dog. They're just the friendliest little things. Oh, that's a far ways down. I just threw that rock. And when it's way more open, you can see a lot farther left. Like for what it's worth, if you come this far, if you want to walk to that peak, it's better. Okay. We'll, we'll just walk here. Yeah. Can I can't do that. No? Nope. Are you just going to wait here or what? Oh, there's, a, there's a living tree to grab to. Kiyama! I will go here. That's even dangerous, sir. Actually, if you fell right here, there's like a nice little like cove thing slot to grab you, if, unless you went with the pinball goes. <laughs> Thank you.
We just arrived on Great Bear Lake a few moments ago and we're just uh, getting all of our stuff settled into camp. The mosquitoes are bad, but it's a really, really beautiful evening. It's only 10 to 8 right now and the sun doesn't really go down. So it's not like we're in a big rush and after we're all setting up, I'm definitely going to be throwing a line in still. Beautiful area. Yeah. Do you have one too? Oh, mine might be gone. I have one, yeah. Did we catch a few fish? I don't know. No, this is mine. No, I still got one. Yeah, I still have one. Uh, mine's still a ways away here. We don't really have anything oh yeah, there she is. <laughs> mine's bigger. Got a ways to come here. Oh. oh my gosh. He's getting tired. We just got back from our first evening of fishing. About, just went up to the point there, like about, 200 yards. Yeah, 15 minutes and double header. Right off the bat, mine's a little bit bigger, <laughs> but we're gonna fry them up or? We each thought the other person was joking when we saw them like, oh yeah, like celebrating, I got a fish and then. I thought Kiyomo was cheering me on cause I was reeling one in and she was also reeling one in. So. And then I thought that we were hooked on like the same fish or just each other. So I lost hope and then I saw mine and then Skylar gave him the fight and Pull them both in and now we're gonna have some supper. Yep, fill it up and cook them up. Look at the view from the outhouse. End of day one. It is just about 11.30 at night. Doesn't look like it. Sun is still got a few hours to set, but. Skylar just finished his poop. Why would you say that? It wasn't very good. I got eaten alive by mosquitoes. Alrighty, well, I guess we'll go fish some more tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Good morning. We're just starting day two now. 
Woke up, had some bacon and eggs. Beautiful morning. In there is all maybe, I don't know, 15 feet average ish. And then we're here, I don't know, 40 or something at most, but it's all every, everywhere this entire bay is only 20. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. That is nice. Yeah. Is that ever? Oh, he's great. Yeah. That is a nice fish. Fish of the day. Hopefully not, but they get so far of the trip. Okay, right. let's get him in the water. I got one too. Hey. Yeah, he's kind of like this one's a lot more silver. Well, this one's bigger. Yeah, you can just let mine go if you're able to. That's that subspecies, eh? Yeah. It's bad as a tuna. <laughs> nice. He's still pretty greenish. Is that one not yours? No, that one's yours right there that we just released. Oh. Mine's right over here. Oh. Oh. Probably about the size of mine last night. Might be a bit smaller, you don't think? Oh no, he's quite small still. You need a half? Yours might be bigger. Yeah, yours is bigger than last night's guy. You want one up here again? I think so. Falling. There you go. Great Bear Lake. like a bigger one, hey? I don't think so, it's not in the boat. This morning, so we're going out this evening. Gotta catch some supper, so hopefully he's up to his task. She caught five, and I caught one. Almost, I should have been six, yeah. but I There's just one. didn't land it. Got off right at the boat, so yeah. it doesn't count still. But she also got the biggest of the trip so far too on her first and one I this morning. And I caught a hook in the water that was like yeah. snagged and left there, so I rub it in. Yeah. Okay, so we'll uh, catch some supper tonight. That's our bear dog right there. He's supposed to uh, scare the grizzly bears away. 
he likes boat rides. Get Nova. Thanks, girl. Is that yummy, bud? Supper tonight. Two. Oh, lake trout. Let's look at the difference in the colors of them just from the terrain that they were caught. It's pretty cool. I'm no expert at this. I did my first one just yesterday, so. I think our plan tonight is to grill these ones on the campfire. Look at that nice color, hey? Not as red as last night's. time on the moment outdoors.